Hello everybody and welcome back. It is episode 20 and as you can see I am over at the stronghold standing in front of the portal which holds the dragon. I'm kind of excited but I'm also kind of not excited. Like I said I don't have a lot of experience fighting the dragon despite how long I've been playing this game which is four years. I've seen the dragon twice. So yeah you know this will be fun. Let's get into it and, and see what kind of crazy we have. It Okay, that's not great. Oh, perfect. Perfect. I was afraid this would be the problem. Terrifying. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Don't look at the Endermans. Don't look at the Endermans. We're okay. Are we, are we safe? Oh my goodness. This is not ideal at all. So I do have a plan because I did go ahead and build a, another portal. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't pay any attention to the coordinates, so that's that's problematic. So let's see what we got here. Yeah, I know. You're very upset and angry with me. There we go. You have fun. Uh, let's see what we got. That one's caged. That one is also caged. Don't look at the Endermans. See if I can take out a few of these here. Nope. There we go. Please. Maybe. Oh, come on. Really? Look how bad I am at aiming. Oh. Don't look at the Endermans! Stop your craziness. Alright, so that one's pretty tall. I could. Don't look at the Endermans! The Endermans are. They don't. They don't want my. Go. Go away. Get on out of here. Okay, I got that one. Oh. All right, so oh man, they freak me out. See if I can get up here before she pegs me. Eventually, it'll. There we go. Face. Oh, don't, don't. Oh, oh my. Thank you. Oh, I took my darn... Oh, don't, don't, oh! Oh, <laughs> that's so sad. I'm gonna have to try it again, and that is A-OK. -okay. Do I still have a golem around here? She done took care of him. You gonna hit me again? Because you're irritating? I just, I just wanna, I just, please, please. There we go. That, that'll be slightly better. If I could get into one of the cage ones, I've had luck trying to peg some of the other towers from the higher vantage point. <gasps> oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, I would have been so... <sighs> I'm having a hard time breathing. Well, this is unbelievably irritating. I can't begin to tell you. This end is awful. Okay, well that's nice, I guess. That one is still caged. Oh, that's so frustrating. Especially because she already pegged me once off of that and it makes me nervous trying it again. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Oh, I, I just... 
don't trust any of this. Oh, no, 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 please don't. Oh. Yep. All my gear is gone. Well. Crap. I'm going to I'm going to go in my house and cry now. Yep. I'm I'm just going to cry. Uh... <laughs> yep. I quit. All right, so the death has happened. The utterly traumatizing, debilitating death that makes you feel defeated and as if you might slightly possibly be a failure. And you just watch it happen and you think, man. All that hard work down the drain. But all is not lost, I guess. We still have the pick of awesome, which kind of makes me happy. One of the things that I try to go for as soon as I can is to get a really nice pickaxe. So, of course, I had left this in the ender chest on the off chance that I got killed and I am surprised that I died because like I said in my intro video to the channel I defeated the end dragon for the first time in playing the game on hard mode <laughs> so I was really shocked to have been thrown off the ledge and it's kind of my fault. I probably should have had some, uh, you know, some pearls. Some pearls down here in the hot bar space. But I did not. So, this is what we're going to do. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead uh, and make some new stuff. And I'm just going to start over again. Because that is the thing that you do in this game. Every great once in a while. Do I do I have sticks? I have some wood. That's a good thing. Can I sleep? Okay. <laughs> Man. Oh. I just I just said, you know what? Never mind. Walked away from the computer. <laughs> Went and cut myself up an apple. Sliced up a little bit of cheddar cheese. And uh had myself a nice light lunch and the entire time I was shaking my head smacking myself like I can't believe that that happened I am ever so irritated by the fact that that is a thing that has occurred oh my gosh why is there a slime out there wait a minute wait a minute that's not Where did you come from? Man, if I had a name tag... If I had a name tag, I would name you. I'm sorry. I thought, I thought this was, uh... You know what? I don't even remember what I named that slime. What was his name? Hopper? Jumper? I can't remember what I named the little guy. He ended up escaping and just vanishing. He must have come out of the mine because there's a slime chunk down there and he might have just hopped into the bubble stream and got brought up here. But anyway, had a light lunch, felt irritated and frustrated and sad and was just like, oh man, but I can't just, you know, give up. I'm not really that person and I've been working so hard on the world. I mean, it's looking good and we got the giant farm way out there with the, the awesome kelp farm, but I think part of the reason I was so discouraged was because <laughs> I had spent a long time working on the kelp farm because, you know, I, I kind of wanted it to be a neat thing and I wanted it to produce and do what it's supposed to do. And 
then the bottom part of it, the smelter, didn't exactly work. So that was a little frustrating because I had spent some time on it and I was like, man, I'm going to have to tear it out and redo all of that. So then I'm like, okay, you know what? Let me just take a break from this. I'll head on out to the stronghold and, you know, see if I can take care of the dragon, maybe get the little dragon egg and make myself a neat little space to put it. And then the dragon killed me. So it was just like one setback after another and it was just so heartbreaking. <laughs> so heartbreaking. And it was even better when I went back and watched the footage. And I was like, oh, ah! I just wanted to scream and like throw my keyboard. But that's not a thing that I that I did. Um, I stopped throwing things out of out of gaming rage <laughs> when I was quite young. And that's as a direct result of my totally awesome mom. But yeah, so uh, I'm gonna spend some time doing some uh, some killing of things. Oh goodness, I don't even get the one hit kill anymore. It's so sad and depressing. So I'm gonna spend some time killing some things and getting some experience and see if I can get this gear back up to snuff. I'm definitely not gonna have, oh man, three pieces of mending armor. Okay. <laughs> I lost everything. I lost everything. I, I just have to accept it as reality. I lost everything. So I'm going to spend some time getting myself back together. And I guess we'll try the dragon again. And yeah. So be right back. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. I am now back. It is a couple of days later and... <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and attempt to do this again. We'll actually just have to see how it goes. Got my silk axe. Got some of my armor back here. I did not put mending on anything, even though I've got mending books. I decided that because it's so difficult to get them, I'm just not gonna worry about it. So I have my silk axe. I got the monster hunter back. It's a little bit better than it used to be because I think the other one only had looting two. Now we have looting three. So if I lose this one, I'll probably be a little irritated, but it's okay. It just means I'll have to go find more diamonds and blah, blah, blah. I also have gone on ahead and gotten my kit ready again. And uh, this time I've got ender pearls on the bar. So hopefully I can be fast enough to save myself if it comes to that. Obviously, I'm like super nervous about this because I've already failed once. Um, probably gonna do my best to not speak a lot, so who knows? This might be a really fun musical montage instead. <laughs>
want anything to do with this end. Yep. Let me see if I can. Alrighty. And yeah. There we go. Alright. I'm just gonna chuck this guy in here. <laughs> that was really stressful. That was really stressful. But you know what? Glad it's over. And uh, not terribly looking forward to that whole exploring in cities thing. So, you know, we're going to call it, we're going to call this done. You know, I died. I felt frustrated by that death. I went and I blew some stuff up and, and rebuilt my armor and did some things to think about anything other than the dragon. But now that the dragon is dead, I will attempt to go and, and deal with the end and, and try to get some, some useful things so that I can really start to enjoy, or at least, well, not start to enjoy. I have been enjoying it. Go back to enjoying the safety that is the overworld. <laughs> <laughs> is what we're gonna say. So I hope you enjoyed the episode regardless of all my crazy and uh, I hope to see you later. I, and I mean that genuinely in a manner of speaking. This has been Abby over and out.